Have you ever imagined waking up and suddenly speaking in a completely different accent, British, Jamaican, or even Chinese, without ever having been to those places? This isn't a movie plot. It's a real condition called foreign accent syndrome, and it's one of the rarest and strangest neurological mysteries in the world. Take Linda Walker, for example. A woman from Newcastle, England, who suffered a stroke in 2006. When she woke up, she didn't just lose part of her movement, she gained what sounded like a Jamaican accent. Linda had never been to the Caribbean. She said, I thought I was going mad. Doctors confirmed the stroke had affected the language center in her brain, causing her to pronounce vowels and consonants differently. Another well-known case is Tiffany Roberts, a woman from Indiana who developed foreign accent syndrome after suffering a stroke in 1999. Before the stroke, she spoke with a standard American accent. But after her recovery, people noticed something strange, she sounded like she was from the UK, even though she had never been there and had no connection to British English. Then there's Lisa Alamia, a mom from Rosenberg, Texas. After jaw surgery in 2016, her Texan accent vanished. In its place. A crisp, British-sounding voice. Her own kid said, Mom sounds weird now. Lisa had never left the US, but suddenly sounded like she was raised in London. Her story made national news, from CNN to Good Morning America. And perhaps the most surprising case, Sarah Colwell, from Plymouth, England. After experiencing repeated, severe migraines, her voice transformed into something that sounded East Asian. People on the street were often rude, assuming she was mocking an accent. But doctors confirmed the change was real, her migraines had caused neurological damage that altered her speech. Foreign accent syndrome may sound bizarre, even fake. But for those who live with it, it's a daily struggle to be understood, in more ways than one. Foreign accent syndrome is typically caused by damage to specific brain regions, Broca's area, controls speech production, motor cortex, responsible for muscle movements needed for speaking, cerebellum, affects rhythm, timing, and pitch. It's not about learning an accent, it's about changes in how the brain controls speech sounds. The result? A person speaks in a way that resembles another accent, but it's actually their own brain's misfiring speech system. So, what do you think, is foreign accent syndrome one of the strangest brain conditions you've ever heard of? Let me know in the comments.